welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Medita and um, I mean you can tell already what I'm going to be doing today just by the title of the video but also by looking at these beautiful book stacks because today I am finally organizing my bookshelf again after being in the US for two months but th th there's a lot going on here. We have a lot of books which means, drum roll please, we're building a new bookshelf! wondering, Medita, where are you even going to put the bookshelf? And let me tell you where. My inner architect came out and I decided to finally make a corner bookshelf, which means that I will finally build another bookshelf on that wall so that all of these books can find a home and my room will look so beautiful and not messy at all afterwards. And I'm so excited. And let's just get started with building this bookshelf. We should start off with this one. Oh god. I've done this a million times already, this exact same bookshelf. How hard can it be? You know what I mean? Maybe I've messed up in the past, but I will not be messing up today. <laughs> belly! Bob the Builder is about to build the belly shelf. Right. Okay, I remember this. Totally. Put it. Thank God I went to the gym yesterday. Now I have all these new extra muscles to push these thingies in. Or so I thought, oh my God, what the heck? Uh oh, that went in a bit too far. No, I can't get it out. Well, my poor hand is gonna be in pain again. I forgot how painful doing this was. Also, I do not have an electrical, um, me today to get the screws in so it's gonna take a lot longer but that also means I cannot hurt myself and I cannot mess up so am I really disappointed that I don't have it with me I don't know how did I do this the last time so often oh my god <sighs> my hand is already looking funny <gasps> where's my hammer Screw. So since I didn't know which one I had to get, I have a total of six. Let's find out which one is the correct one. Let's just start screwing. How many? <laughs> Pray for me. Twist. Ah. Oh, it's heavy. Now it's serious. We're getting down to business. This is the rough area, so the rough area has to meet the rough area. Oh no. Push! Ah. Like this. Uh oh. Why is there a wood coming off? Okay. 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 <sighs> I needed that to replenish my soul. Now let's get started. Wait, no. Do I first put the board up? Yeah, because like if I twist these in already, how's the board gonna fit in? Not today, Sherlock. We're not doing things wrong. Oh lord. Ow! Yeah. It's way too warm in here. Twist. 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 Oh my gosh, now we have to do the back board and then we're done. We're going so fast, faster than the furious. What a lie. Very floppy. Whoa. Oh my god. Now I remember that I have to draw a line here too. Where's my ruler? Do I even have a ruler? No. So we're going to be using this DIY ruler. Now this is where I will mess up. Because if the nails are not in straight, the shelf is ruined and it looks ugly. Like, I, I did that mistake once over there and it looks ugly fugly. So we're not trying to do that again. Which means we have to hammer very straight. Am I nervous? Yes. I did everything perfect. Yeah! Now let's do the up top thingy and then we're already done with shelf one and we can go on to doing shelf 
two. Is there an instruction in here? I don't remember. There isn't. Oh, okay, no, no, no. Here it is. Made in Sweden. Cool. Okay, now do we do the skinny ones or the thicky Mickey ones? The thicky Mickey ones. I just push that in with one of my fingers. Yeah, finger strength. See, I never, this is the step I always mess up on. Is that the one? Yeah, cause, okay, okay, okay. It's correct, it's correct, right? Yeah, I'm done with shelf one. Oh my gosh. What do I do now? I move this. I think I'm just gonna put it like on my bed, just as a whole. Let's just not fall. <laughs> Goodbye, my beautiful picture corner. I will miss you. Now, I'm not gonna put it in all the way yet. I'm just gonna put it up so I kind of like see what it looks like because this obviously has to be pushed over. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. I'm so strong. It's not gonna stand like this. It's gonna be like, like this, but like obviously at the wall. So like, you get it? And then like, ooh. So it has to be at an angle so like this is like a clean edge. This is gonna be so nice! Okay, I'm gonna build the second thing off camera and then I'll come back and I'll show you what we did in. So let's go build it! We have to now push all these shelves over, which means we have to get all the books out, or at least quite a lot, because fully honestly, how am I ever going to lift all of these, okay? Like, I know I'm strong and that I have muscles, and that I'm basically Chris Hemsworth 2.0, but I don't have that many muscles, okay? First, I'm just gonna remove all the books that are just lying around, because they don't even have a spot, so they don't have a home, so they're just gonna be homeless on my bed for a second, and then we're gonna slowly start removing first the special difference from the top because they're gonna fall and decapitate us all and then we're gonna start removing from the top to bottom and then push them over and i'm so excited so yeah let's remove all the loose books i also am probably gonna pay attention a bit to the books that i'm gonna be unhauling soon because i have read a few really bad books again which i'm going to be unhauling soon so those are going to be put to the side whoa okay let's first remove all the special editions since those are the dangerous ones Oh lord. Oh, my arms are gonna be so sore, but at least I'm gonna have muscles after this. I got it. I'm almost done. Yes! Success! Let me take a sip of this. I need energy for this. My arm. Okay. Oh, okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start removing the top row of this, and then when I'm done with each row, I'm gonna check how heavy it is to see if I can lift it out. Because then also, smart thinking, I might have to organize less. Actually, that's a total lie. I don't know why I think I will ever have to organize less because where am I gonna put all the- <laughs> Because where am I gonna put all the- Why is that a heart attack? Wow, that was fun. Um, what I was gonna say before my shelves rudely interrupted me was I'm gonna have to reorganize some of these shelves anyways because of all the new books I got. Oh my god. Oh, I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. So talented. I think I'm gonna have to do like two more rows and then I'm gonna be able to carry it. I hope so. We're gonna see, but I really do think I'm gonna have to move that much. So that's set. I'm struggling. Honestly, I've been trying to push these shelves into the corner correctly for the past two hours. It's not working, guys. I'm about to lose my mind. I'm frustrated. I'm sweating. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. 
I don't want to do this anymore, okay? Maybe, maybe I just need a new hobby because what the heck is happening? My perfectionist brain is telling me that I cannot and will not stop until the corners align perfectly. My floor ever is saggy, which means that my bookshelves tilt. And I've been trying to use cardboard and these like little slope thingies and it's not working. Ugh. I just removed all the books from this show so I can actually move it from the floor because Vanessa had to leave so she can't help me. Why did I decide to do this again? I don't really know. Um, I will never understand decisions I make, but let's, let's continue and let's try to do it. Ugh! Why am I doing this to myself? Okay guys, I think I got it. Well, I won't be getting it any better, I'm pretty sure, just because of like how my room is built, but I, th I think I got it guys. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah. Literally, I'm so talented, guys. I'm like a architect. Look at this. Um, the only thing is, obviously, we have a gap here, but I really, I really can't fix it. Um, or at least I don't know how I would without like destroying all of this again, which is the hardest part because I would have to like tilt this like that a little bit. But I tilted it this way, so we'll pick with this one. Girl, I don't, I don't know. Okay, like it's hard. But this is the best I think I'm gonna do. I kind of like it. I mean, wh where is a bookshelf with no gap? You know what I mean? It's not that visible. It's okay. Everything is like fixed into the wall. Put the wood thingies in. I just got myself an ice cream because I'm like so exhausted and I need sugar in my body. So I got um, Piruto Cactus. These bad boys. Anyways, now the next big step is what genre goes where. And the chair is going to be here. I feel like it's going to perfectly fit into the corner. Obviously, I won't be able to reach the corner down there a lot. I mean, I can just move the chair as I just did, which means books I'm like really not the biggest fan of will go down there. So I'm thinking, yet again, fantasy here, right? But just instead of doing this one, I'll do this one and then do thriller and mystery on this one. And then we'll see you because I honestly don't know. I'm going to eat this and let's go. Oh! Wait, I wanted to show you the aftermath of this. So we have books over here, books here, and then all of these, all of my special editions, and more books. These are all the ones I need a home. I think, I think it's gonna work, right? Ow, they're so heavy, whoa! <sighs> I'm already exhausted. Oh my God. Whoa. I don't think that was good. I just sat against it. Is it okay again? I think so. Now, what is this and why is this here? No. What the heck are these books and why were they down there? Stop it. Ah! First done, then we go to this side. Okay, okay, more I don't know yet for down here. We'll figure it out. Let's go to the row above. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's just move shadow me over. That's something I can't mess up, you know? Where are the rest of my shadow me books? That's the real question, because I'm missing quite a lot. Let's move this over. <gasps> and I have to change something here too because I got more books by V.E. Schwab. Ah! Hmm. Now, what do I do again? Ah. Ow! Where were. Wait! Oh! Okay, okay, I remember something. Sorry. This was here. Yeah, look at that. Now, why is Heartless there? That doesn't fit. And then, yeah. I'm pretty sure, like these I don't have to change, so I can just put them back. Ah! Oh god, oh no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, that would have been painful. Woo! This one was right next to it, right? Why do I have the 100 homecoming twice? Now I have just the middle one left. I mean, these are the ones that are left. But I feel like the good ones should go into that one, you know what I mean? So like the Hunger Games? I'll just do Divergent, I guess. No! Oh my god! Stop! That looks good, doesn't it? Now let's continue with the fantasy. Hmm, what could I do? <sighs> the dystopian was all over there, so let me get those over here really quickly. Okay, don't fall. And then... Or a dire. Okay, I have an idea. My brain is tingling. I think I'm doing really well right now. Like, I'm going so fast and my brain is braining. What's another dystopian that I could put up here? Does anyone know? 
It's not like I'm talking to a camera that I cannot respond. Now that I'm doing this not sideways anymore, I can actually do a full on pirate shelf. That's freaking awesome. Mermaids, oh my gosh, they're all gonna go on the same shelf. It's gonna look so good, I love this already. These, what else is ocean? I really thought I would have more. Huh, well, well this is difficult now. I thought I was doing so well, but now that I'm looking at it, I'm actually full on struggling. What the heck? I just have like a bit more space up there, but I feel like I'll find something that belongs to that type of like genre, you know? <gasps> Oh my god, Stephanie Garber goes here. What am I even doing? Whoa. Whoa. What if I do Bridget Kemmerer? Does that make sense? That looks okay. Kind of like it. Why not, you know? Oh my god, I'll just move Victoria Aviart up here. And then I have space for the third book in the Young Elite series. Big brain energy. Ugh. Why is it so big? Why? Oh my god, wait, okay, I need to get all my new books now because honestly, let's organize those by genre really quickly so I kind of know where the more fantasy has to go. Ignore my member bookmarks, okay? I don't know what they are. Let's go through these. This is a special edition, so I'll put to the side. I'm just gonna take a stack and then put it to where everything else is from those authors. V.E. -E. <laughs> Shatter me. I don't know. Dystopian. This is just a good book. Another copy of Ignite Me. Another copy of Ignite What am I doing with three copies of Ignite Me? Holly Black. Another copy of Once Upon a Broken Heart since I can't get enough. Oh my god. How is this all gonna fit? I don't know. Hmm. Let's now do my shadowing really quickly. I swear it's not gonna all fit on here and then I'm gonna be super sad. Yeah, I don't know what I thought, but this is not working. What the heck? What am I gonna move? No! What are we moving? I think I'm gonna move the UK then. Oh no! What am I gonna do with this? Guys, what do I do? My shadowy shrine is too low. Okay, let's not focus on this because it's gonna make me super sad. Let's just do the other stuff that we know how to do. Ooh! Everyone, this one looks so good. I see how it is. It's looking hot and sexy. Holly Black. These are like fancy books. I don't really know. Why are they bigger? I thought they were gonna be the same size. No. What do we have down here? Nothing of use. Wow. Really? That works a bit better, you know? Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Whatever, major loser. I'm never gonna speak again. Yeah. What could fit up here? We're getting somewhere, I think. And I like that a lot, actually. Well, now I'm stuck again, so. I think fifth season should go on this shelf. And then Mistborn, I have Brandon Sanderson books. So those will all go together, if that makes sense. Okay, let's not drop them. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. Whoa, what was backwards? I'm also realizing I have way more space than I thought I would. For some reason, I thought it was gonna be way fuller. So that's a bit concerning. I'll move Brandon Sanderson into here. So let me just get them in the correct order. Okay, let me like figure out this one really quickly because it's pretty easy. I just have to move all of my Cassandra Clare books. Ow! Ow, my arm! My poor hands and legs and everything. I just need... <coughs> Sorry, everyone. Well, this is actually really sad and I don't know what to do. Yeah, guys, that's it. I don't have any more. I mean, I can, like, put my shadow me somewhere else, which is, like, super stupid. But what then? Ay, ay, ay. I'm gonna cry. I don't know what to do. Oh, my God. Percy Jackson can obviously be on the shelf. Duh. Ah, I don't know. And now a book fell over. It's a bit loose, but it works. There's a bit of space down here. I'll just move these. I'm sorry, everyone. This is gonna have to do, and it works. I like this. Let me look from far away. Yeah, I like this. This looks good. Kind of. I don't know. 
I want to see, I want to see what this would look like with a chair since that was my goal from the beginning. Oh my god, guys. Wait a second, let me see it. Oh, f Are you kidding me? And you're trying to tell me this isn't iconic looking? Because this is iconic. Oh. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, this is great. I don't even want to continue building. I just want to be in here now because this is awesome. I'm happy. I'm loving life. I just want to sleep. Ugh, I'm never going to move again. I need to. Let's now do my thriller section and romance somehow. Oh, lordy lord. I got it. Ah. Oh, God. We now have to do this one, which is the important one. And I don't know if I have enough to do what I want to do. So I have got like one new book. I kind of wanted to do Jennifer Lynn Barnes again up here with a combo of A Good Girls. Oh my God, so I now have these covers signed. It looks so good. Look at the matching spines. Look at this. Ah! Let's do some adult thrillers in here. I feel like that could make sense. Oh, wow. Look at me go. It fits perfectly. Holy, holy hell. Yeah, this is great. Now I have to figure out this shelf though. So that's not that great. And I also don't know where I should put the historian now because it's so big. What is up with this big book? Like, what do you have to say? Okay, thought I would be able to fit it all. Isn't this great? No, it's not. Ew, that does not work. There's a lot of space. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! We're gonna leave this and we're gonna go to the next shelf. I am very close to just giving up, but I won't. So let's do romance now because I feel like it's gonna be more easy than all the other stuff I plan on doing. No! Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Oh my God, it fell over. And then this bad boy just right next to it. Oh, that's heavy. Come on. Okay. Ah. Ah. Oh, Lord. Okay. Oh, gosh. I'm so strong, but also so weak at the same time. It's an awful combination. Oh, yo, yo. Let's figure out what I can do next, which is absolutely nothing. I don't know why I thought I could do this. Wow! These are all YA books, which means they kind of belong in this row. Maybe I can do like two YAs over there and then like do the boxes? I don't know. But I really have nothing else going for me. It's just like a curse. Stay. Stay. What if I just like give up? Seems pretty good to me right now, that idea but I can't because I'm not an upgiver. I am a continue slayer, so we have to continue. I think what I should do is move these rows over there or like these rows over there and then do the boxes. And then Ashley all has to be together, obviously. So that works. Ooh, okay, I like that too. Next row. Come on now, it can't be that difficult. It's already difficult, so I don't know why I said that. Now let me figure out this section. Yeah. Hmm, what can I move down here? Well, goodbye, Anna. I have to now stop side second Krista. Oh my God, that's gonna ruin the shrine and I already hate it. Whatever, actually maybe it does fit. Oh, it does. Why did I ever side stack it? Because it fits perfectly. Heck yeah. That makes me happy. Okay, now let me move these down here. <sighs> I'm really hindering it. Goes here. I have two rows extra, guys. That is not okay. What the heck am I supposed to do? I mean, I have some stuff still over there. Do I really move that now then? Ugh. So top row. Devil Wears Prada, and all the old classics. Ah! And 
I still have space. What the heck? Ay, ay, ay. Wow, so I have two free. I love my life. Oh, I have more than two free. No, honestly, what do I do? Because that's ugly. I need to move books from under my bed, which I have banned from my shelf. I need to move them back here. Ugh. I've decided to move the Zodi Academy as well as all the Sophie Lauren books onto my big shelf because those are like the only ones under my bed where I'm like, I kind of want them on my big shelf if I could. And then I hope that'll like take up a large part of my shelf because right now I need it. What do you have to say that it has to be this big? I don't, I'm confused. Well, I still have one entire roll left. Hi, aye, aye. Okay, so this is where we are right now. I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna start doing my special editions because since I'm putting so many sideways because I wanna show the pretty covers, the ones that I kind of could put on the shelf, I'm putting to the side, like the Adorari of Blood special edition because it could fit on the shelf and then I would have more space used, if you know what I mean. And yeah, let, let's just try it, you know, let's go. I don't know why I didn't think about this earlier, but the fact that I put my shelves on these wooden plates and stuff like that made them uneven up top. So the books were kind of on a slope as well and almost falling over, especially the ones at the corner. Like my Babel book, oh my gosh, it fell down two times almost. It was not doing well. I put a piece of cardboard now behind it so it wouldn't fall into the hole because if it does, I will have to move all my bookshelves. Do you know how stupid that is? I don't know why I'm deciding to risk this, but I, I live life on the edge, so I continue to doing it. Anyways, I found a few special editions I was going to put on my main shelf, mostly Roman special editions, like from the bookworm box, as well as I already said, a drawery of blood. And you know what? It worked pretty well. I'm really happy that I got those off because I, I needed every book I could get for my main shelf. You will see in a second the issues I had to face, and they were not fun, okay? They were not fun. Am I still content with the end result? Of course I am, but still, I was struggling. I'm doing something really dumb. If I have enough fairy tales or stories that were turned into Disney movies or childhood books and Greek mythology books to fill one shelf, I will be moving it down below the horror books and move the YA books up there and up there. Because I, I kid you not, I don't know what else to do. I have no idea. I'm, I'm clueless. I'm stuck, everyone. I think this is all I have. I've given up. What do I add? Poetry? Oh, oh no, do I really have to put books under my bed? No. Okay, let's just organize the side shelf first. I want the big hardbacks to be here, like the fairy tale ones at least now. Because they're so pretty. Well, I do like that. Let's not even lie. I do like that. So I'm just going to keep this for now. This is also not one of these class. Oh, oh my gosh. Do you see that? Whoa, that's ugly. The old ones are way prettier. Oh my gosh. First, the common, which is all these tiny books. Now this is French, so I can just do my French border then here, even though I have more German books over there. I don't know. Yeah, you know what? I'm kind of digging it. I'm kind of digging it. So technically this one does not have to be moved, so I will not. Well, actually, like I feel like these books belong up there though. Why do I have three copies of Breakfast at Tiffany's? What is this? Why? This goes on the main shelf in the thriller section and these both go into the rom-com section, so that's fun. Let's go! Okay, so I found a few more books that I could put up here and I just need to like have it be enough so I have another shelf built and I'm fine. So we have The Mile High Series by Tina Swan and I only like the second book, but you know, I like it a lot, so why not? Jonathan Bell! I never put it on my shelf because the other books by the author I don't really like at all. Then I have these obviously still and I need like, what? Two more books? Ah, come on. Think, Medita. Oh, yes. Now, organizing. Let's go. I'm gonna move these down and then move what up? Probably the Lauren Asher books. I'll move these here and move Tessa Bailey up there. I think that's a bit better, right? That works, right? Let's just do a little switcheroo, you know? Ah, stop falling over. No, no. Oh my god. 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 Ah. This will just be spread out. You know what? It works. It's a bit loose. All of them are, but I'm done. Okay, I'm done. 
It looks done. I'm so happy I'm finally done. I'll give a little bit of an overview now really quickly. And yeah, <sighs> I'm exhausted. This took me over 10 hours, but you know what? I'm happy I did this. So let me just show you really quickly. First, obviously the main shelf. We have my fantasy slash dystopian corner. Yay! So like always, the top row is memory stuff. Then we have like fantasy stuff. As I said, this is my mermaid section. Books I love, books I love. Random books, random books, random books. Fantasy, fantasy, fantasy. V. Schwab, Shadow Me Shrine, dystopian, right? That's kind of the overview from this side of my shelf. Love it. Then we have these, which are a bit confusing because we have thriller, thriller, mystery, thriller, dark academia. These are like horror books, but like we're like mystery books with a bit of magic. YA, YA. YA, 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 but sad. And these are books turned into movies and like women's fiction stuff. And then we have my romance section again. Just like always the exact same rom-com sections, but I added at the bottom the Sophie Lark books and all of these. So these two bros are all under my bed technically. So ignore that, but it just like fits and ties everything in together. And then on this side, Dun, 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 dun. This is what she looks like. We have my three rows of classics and like fairy tales and Greek mythology. General fiction, but like with a focus on women's sexuality and then general fiction and general fiction. But there's also like very deep stories in there. Oh, and obviously my tiny books. And I didn't change anything here. So that's my little overview, everyone. Now I'm going to sit down in my chair. I am in love. I'm so happy about this shelf now especially with the combo of this chair, I literally will sit here and be like, hmm, what can I read? And I'll be like, oh my gosh, Furyborn. La, 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 la. What a great day. And then at the end of the day, I'm like, oh, I'm so tired. Let me put my book back. And I don't even need to stand up. So great. Thank you all so much for watching today's bookshelf building and organization video. I had a lot of fun, but I was also really stressed and tired and sweaty at the same time. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you can do a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of my content, you can subscribe. I'm honestly amazed that this worked out in any way, shape or form. I know there's like some mistakes over here, for example, with a little gap, but I think it's fine. I hope you all have a great day, even at time morning, whatever time's on in. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Go read a book, okay? Um, what should we read? Let me just close my eyes and think of something. Read The Gilded Wolves by Roshani Chosky. It's a mystery, decadence, and dangerous desire book in Paris, because there's an Eiffel Tower. So thank you all again so much for watching this video. Have a great day, happy reading, and see you next time. Bye! <laughs>